my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's, What's the procedure, calm? everyone? What's the procedure? Stay calm! Wait, 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 wait. Everybody, you calm down! Hey guys, welcome to this video. Today we're going to be talking about The Flash Season 5 and we've got some more news in regards to Godspeed. We've got our first official look at him, so if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. So once again, sorry for the microphone quality. I know it wasn't very loud yesterday. I'll turn this up in post-production, but I don't think the mic can pick up, you know, super loud frequencies. So I'll amp that up and I'm just sorry for the quality and how it sort of cuts out in and off. So anyway, let's go ahead and talk about this. We got some new exclusive news from Pagey. He's got some news in regards to what Godspeed's doing in the episode. And we've got a new photo from a photographer in Vancouver from Brittany Charlotte. And she's got our first look at Godspeed in his costume we've got to freak out about this this is not fake this is 100 percent real canada graphs confirmed it so let's go ahead and get right into this so we'll talk about the suit because that's what everyone wants to talk about okay so you see this suit on the screen right now and the first time i saw it i got sent it on twitter earlier today i freaked out this is amazing this is totally 100 percent comic book accurate it is absolutely amazing and you can see it's got the same color scheme, it's white and gold, and the suit is literally basically the same as the comics. Maybe it has a bit less of the gold, but obviously they can amp up, you know, the lightning and stuff in post-production when he's finally going to be in the episode. In episode 18, I have to emphasize it's episode 18, so get ready for that. We're only three episodes off, I believe, because we've got episode 15, 16, 17, 18. We've got four episodes actually and that is crazy so he's coming really soon we'll talk about some theories and some of the stuff he's going to be doing soon but let's break down the suit first all right so if we go in and we go and zoom into his head because this photo is actually really good quality we get to see his mask and his mask is very similar to zooms and i really like it he looks very demonic although it's all white and gold i love his ears how it sort of goes in from his cheek and goes out past his head like the flash lightning bolt and his eyes are hollowed out they are just black like zooms and i love that it looks very demonic and i really do hope he's actually like the main villain for next season like they actually set up this season so that godspeed's gonna come back in time and it's seemingly confirmed he's probably from 2049 in this due to the fact that this is 2049 they're shooting these scenes in and so what happens if he does come back in time? I think that's very interesting. All right, so moving down, we get to see his chest. He's got like some really nice patterns on the suit and the suit inside of it has this sort of gold streaks going throughout the suit. And you see that he has his gold gloves on both hands and it's just really nicely detailed and very comic book accurate to see, you know, the cracks in his character and the cracks in the suit is sort of like symbolic of him and his sort of broken nature and we move down and we see that on his belt is like a sort of two-piece belt rather than just like a complete one like Barry and it's gold and then we move down to his legs and you see that he's got the lightning bolts on his legs and the lightning bolts on his boots as well so in this scene he is in fact doing some sort of stunt because you can see he's being held up by wires and so there is going to be a fight it's either between Nora or probably Barry, but I think it's more likely to be Nora. So I don't know if this is like a new villain that's going to be appearing in 2049, but Captain Singh never mentioned it in the Flash Museum. So that's very interesting. And so that's when people have been theorizing, actually specifically Pagey, came up with the idea of maybe he turns into Red Death at one point. Maybe this is something we're seeing in the past because... We know in this scene there is Nora, and Nora is in fact wearing her old ponytail, so not wearing, but you know, her hair is in that old style we saw in season 4, and it's not the short hair version, and we know there's the short hair version of Nora in this scene, or you know, in a few other scenes in the future, so are we looking in the past, or are we looking in the future, does the 
future Nora have this ponytail rather than the past Nora. So that's very interesting. So maybe he does evolve and become Red Death. Overall, the suit is amazing. I love it and it's 100% a comic book accurate. And let me know what do you think of this in the comments down below. I just love this first look. It's a really, really crisp, nice first look. And then there's also a photo from behind where we can see his back and he's outside the Central City Citizen. Obviously, the guy's got a helmet on because he's doing some sort of stunts. And right now, there's no like real actor beneath it. It's just stunt double because I don't know if they're going to actually reveal August Heart in this episode. But for now, in these stunt scenes, they're not going to use like a real actor that they will use in the TV show. But yeah, on his back, you can see it's got the same sort of gold lining to his suit and it's rather kind of gray white and his belt continues round if you look down his trousers and his shoe is kind of like in one so it's like one whole massive sort of connected shoe that is a bit more like a onesie but it's sort of in the material of like Barry's new suit I would say because it looks a bit flimsy but it doesn't look too flimsy it doesn't look like it's made out of fabric or anything kind of like this sort of plasticky material and yeah so i'm really looking forward to that also there were some photos and there's some sort of exhibition that's going on either in the central city citizen or in the flash museum and there's a poster of the flash and captain cold and it looks like captain cold or it could be cobalt blue i really can't actually tell but yeah there is some sort of exhibition so this is all taking place right in the future in 2049 and so let's move on to talk about Peiji's information so this is what Peiji was able to find out about what's happening in these scenes what they shot last night and so Godspeed will kill a new speedster called Leah and so Leah is in fact Leah Nelson from the comics she's a speedster from Earth 9 so she is officially coming to the TV show but she is going to be killed by Godspeed and Godspeed will in fact take Nora, whether it's a future version or an older version. I believe it's probably an older version of Nora, like in the past, I mean. And so they're going to probably be working together, that being Leah and Nora. And Leah's going to be killed by Godspeed, so that's incredible. You know, introducing a new speedster. Maybe this is the speedster that Jay Garrick was training that we haven't gone back to. Perhaps it is. So that is the specific scene. And Godspeed does kill speedsters in the comic, so I'm guessing his motivations on the TV show are kind of similar. So he kills criminals, but then when he gets fed up and he wants all the power, he in fact kills all the speedsters. He's unable to get Barry, but he in fact kills all the new speedsters from the Speed Force Storm. Whoever got the powers, he kills them, takes their powers, and therefore they die. In the comics, Barry's new girlfriend, Mina, actually supposedly dies, but she comes back. Read the comics, like I said yesterday. It looks like they're probably following a similar comic book storyline and I don't know if this is going to be just a one episode thing I have a feeling they're not just gonna throw it away and be like a trajectory type episode it could perhaps be like a rival thing for like a few episodes but I believe they're gonna continue it and they're setting something up you know teasing it in the future maybe Godspeed comes in the past and is the season 6 villain I think that would be the best possible option and I would love to see him as the season villain and it's just so exciting to actually see a new speedster and we're gonna see two new speedsters in fact in this episode so that's Leah and Godspeed so I really want him to stick around I think the suit is brilliant and so actually turn into the Red Death I think that's a high possibility I like Paige's theory and so with him actually killing all these speedsters in the future does he in fact nearly kill Nora or is he you know something to do with Barry and is he actually a time traveler or is he actually from 2049 I reckon August Hart probably in the TV show is in fact from 2049 but I don't know if he's actually going to you know stick there. I think maybe he will time travel back in time in order so we have to take him on something yeah, I guess a bit similar to Sabotar but he's more along the lines of Zoom he just kills anyone. Any criminal he thinks of himself as sort of like a hero he's more of an anti-hero in the comics but I reckon in this because he's, you know, killing Leah, killing these speedsters. I reckon he's going to be more of a straight up criminal. Yeah, if he does have a lot of time, you know, to shine. I think he could be some sort of anti-hero that we feel for. But in the end, he is a mass murderer. Yeah, so what do you think about all this? What do you think of the suit? What do you think about the first look? Are you excited? And what do you think about the new scene that we got the description of? So anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.